Okay. Ew! Oh. That's disgusting! Oh. What's up, guys? Welcome to Tea Time with Tila. Today I have special guest, Tristan! What's up, guys? How are you? I'm good, how are you? Are you happy to be here? Always happy when I'm with you. All right. Well, it is time to spill some tea. <laughs> Our topic of the day comes from another amazing viewer. Thank you guys for supporting me and DMing me. We're always here to give y'all advice and spill some tea. So she says, hey Tila, one of the girls at my school started a rumor about me. Now she is getting all of her friends to unfollow me on Instagram, which is making me really sad and making it harder for me to feel confident at school. Do you have any advice with this kind of thing? Rumors suck, but if your friends are your real friends, they will know the truth and they will not believe those rumors. Rumors are such like an ongoing thing, whether you're in high school, whether you do social media, whether you're a YouTuber, whatever, I feel like rumors are just like always gonna be started. I've had a lot of rumors start about me and there's so many like funny YouTube videos like, 12 people Tila Dunn has dated. And I'm like, I haven't dated any of these people at all. And all the comments are like, oh yeah, I remember when she dated this person. It's like, no, I never dated that person. I actually had someone who like, that came into my life mm -hmm. with the sole intention to make a video about what it was like hanging out with me. But like, when people are talking about you or starting rumors, like, I know this is gonna sound so cliche. It's like the advice that your mom gives you like when you're in third grade and people are like you know, making fun of you in the playground. But like, it's so true, like, respond to them with kindness mm -hmm. because worst thing you can do is like throw negativity on top of negativity because it just weighs you down. Mm -hmm. It makes you feel worse. Mm -hmm. It's not what happens to you, it's how you react to it it's that true. defines you. Then they feel bad about the way they treated you. And also those negative negative people that are trying to jump into your lives and bring you down, they're only looking for a reaction or looking for a reason to be like, see, this person did this person. They want you to explode. They want you to yell. They want you to be negative because- They want to expose they you. They want to expose yeah. you. So it's like, just be nice to them. And people like that, you just got to kill them with kindness because it's only going to irritate them and only bring you positivity. And you're going to have good karma in your life because you're not being on their negative level. So. <laughs> Now it is time for my favorite segment of the show. Spill or refill. If you don't know how this game works, we are given savage questions, and if we don't answer the questions, we have to refill our teacups with something disgusting. Today's nasty ingredient is ranch! Oh, I don't, I can't even spell it. It's so, that's so ratchet. This, oh. <laughs> I haven't had dairy in like two years. Oh my gosh. Oh, I'm gonna puke. Oh I, I can't even oh look at it. I can't even look. All right, Tristan, are you ready for your <sighs> savage question? I actually have anxiety. <laughs> okay, okay. Ooh! Ooh! Ah, what? Have you ever exposed someone for being shady? I feel like all the time. <laughs> but I mean, not like publicly to everybody, but like to my friends. I want to look out for like the best interests of my friends. And yeah, like... you're really upfront. He has exposed people for being shady. Like, I know. That's the truth. The he has. has been spilled. Drink to that. All right, are you ready? I'm scared. Have you ever exposed someone? Oh, it's the same question. I feel like you just exposed someone like on this show. <laughs> like, in, like, oh the, my the other God, episode. yes, yes, no, I literally have, like yeah. on this show. <laughs> I like straight out exposed. And I spilled the tea, yeah. No, actually, I, quite literally. I, I, I literally, yeah, I have, 100%. <laughs> I hope he doesn't watch this. Yeah. Ooh. What's the worst rumor you've heard about yourself, and was it true? This, like, <laughs> random girl said that I hook up like a chameleon. And I don't even know what that means. <laughs> but, like, probably very spastically. <laughs> what? That, wow, and it's not true? I mean, unless chameleons are really good at hooking up. <laughs> <laughs> Have you ever started a rumor about someone else? Well, <gasps> I don't know if I started. <laughs> don't make me get the ranch out. No, because I don't know if I started a rumor. I was just like hinting at things. She was planting the seeds for a rumor to grow. Like somebody really like did me dirty and there were like facts that this rumor was true also from like other people that like have bad like track records. And I was just like not saying it was true, but I also wasn't saying it wasn't true. I was just like, he's a bad person, so. You were sharing the rumor then? Yeah, maybe. What was the rumor? Oh, I definitely can't say it. All right, so since Tristan and I have been being very truthful spilling the tea, we got an extra bonus question for the two of us. Are you ready to read it? Yeah, let's do it. 
have you ever disliked, like with the thumb, one of your friend's videos? <gasps> oh my god, it's so gross! Oh my god, it's curling! It. It's curling! Oh my god. Okay, yours is way grosser than mine. You mixed mine yours is, in. Ew, I mixed it! Mixed your, at least yours. You left the spoon in there. You gotta drink it with the spoon. Okay, ready? No, you gotta like, you gotta do like a sip. No! <laughs> oh, Three. no, I can't drink. Oh my god. Look okay, at ready? it. Ready? Okay. Ew! Oh. That is disgusting! Oh. It's like. Ah. I, like, I, just, I just went back for a second. What's wrong with me? I don't know. What's wrong with Why me? Why would you do that? I don't know. I don't know what. I don't know what it was. Well, that is all for tea time with Tila. Thank you so much, Tristan. Thank you for having me. You're the best. Thank you for the tea party. <laughs> Let us know in the comments down below what tea you want us to be spilling in the next episode, and we will see you guys next time. Don't forget to thumb up the video and subscribe. Love you guys. Bye. Mwah.